drying and coloring. After molding, the pipes are allowed to dry. Here, the pipes are arranged in batches to dry naturally all over the factory for about 2-3 to three weeks. Clay pipes have been used for plumbing since 4000 BC in Babylonia. They are made from organic materials and are impervious to acids in wastewater and can last for thousands of years. Clay pipes are used for plumbing including in sewer lines and for industrial land. The factory also has an upper deck where the pipes are arranged to effectively utilize the space. Here, industrial conveyor chain is used to transfer the pipes to various sections. Next, the pipes will be dipped into the coloring solution one after the other. This solution is a combined mixture of water and black dye which is made up of chemicals. This increases strength and durability of pipe also to withstand high temperatures. Again, the pipes will be allowed to dry. Baking of pipes After color drying, the conveyor chain is used to transfer the pipes from various places in the factory to the clin. Before loading, the clean will be made free of ash and other debris. Once pipes arrive to the clean, it will be inspected for cracks and will be discarded if any. Tested pipes will be taken inside for burning. Due to heat inside the clin, industrial fans will be used by workers while loading. All the batches of pipes will be loaded into the clin.
The clin consists of various openings to load the firewood and to inspect the level of burning. The hash will be used to make sure the pipes does not stick with one another during burning. The clean entrance will be sealed with bricks and clay coating which traps the heat inside. Firewood is transferred to the top of the clin using conveyor belt and is taken to a cart to various clins for burning. The firewood will be dropped from the top of the clin through the openings which will be burnt using electric burner. Firewood will be dropped continuously to maintain the burn. The clean will be allowed to burn continuously for about 30 to 40 hours approximately. The pipes are burnt to a temperature between 1200 to 1400 degrees Celsius. The pipes will be inspected to ensure proper baking and to stop further burning. Cooling Post burning, the clin entrance will be broken to dissipate the heat inside the clin. The heat and humidity generated in the clin will melt the inner surface which results in melting texture. The hash form after burning will reside in the bottom of burner which will be removed during the cleaning of clean. The openings under the burner are combined to a single tunnel underground which is further connected to the chimney which will transfer the smoke into the atmosphere. The workers inside the clean will face high temperatures due to trapped heat. Hence, industrial fans are used during unloading.
pads will be used to transfer the baked pipes from the cleanse to the cooling site. The shiny texture ensures proper baking of pipes for high strength and durability. Due to heat variations inside the coil, few pipes will be cracked, which will be recycled. Post loading, the cart will be manually pulled and taken to the cooling area. The good quality pipes will be carefully unloaded from the cart and the broken pipes will be put aside for recycling. The pipes will be placed all around the factory until delivery. Delivery Based on the order requirements, the pipes are loaded into the vehicle and will be sent for delivery.